Oh, what's up? What's up? <clears throat> what's going on, everybody? What's up? What's up? How's everybody doing? Welcome, 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 welcome. We at day five, y'all. Day five. We have made it to day five. We made it to day five, y'all. So, uh, dang, hold on. Let me get my Bluetooth real quick. Hey, shout out to the Martin University, man. Shout out to the Martin University. Y'all see it. Martin University. Big brother. Shout out to the Martin University. What's going on, y'all? Hold on, let me get my Bluetooth. It's a little windy out here, so I want to make sure that you guys can hear me today. Uh, this is day five, y'all. I'm on day five now. So, hold up, hold up. There we go, there we go. Try to put my Bluetooth in so y'all can hear me. What's going on? Talk to me. Tell me something good. How y'all doing today? What's up, mama? What's going on, mama? There go my mama. What's going on? Hey, hey, hey. It's Friday. What's up, Andrea? What's going on, lady? It's Friday, y'all. You know? Time to kick back. Time to kick back. You know? Just wanted to come on here, show face, man. Talk to everybody. See how everybody doing. I think I'm going to talk about a little something different. Yes, the weekend is here. The weekend is here. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't convert it over. I'm on the seconds now. So, the weekend is here. What's up, baby? Heart, heart, heart. Love you, girl. So, just to give y'all a little update, I still feel good. CC, they go CC. What's up, CC? Yeah, man, I'm still over here stuck in uh, Mexico. Um, I'm scheduled to take my test tomorrow morning. So at 11 o'clock, I'm going to take my test tomorrow. And um, y'all give me this. Y'all y'all give me this. Y'all post one of these on here real quick. So we can all send that same energy towards that test tomorrow that I get that, uh, that negative so I can come on back home. So y'all put that praying hand up for me one time. Y'all put that praying hand up for me. You know, um, so I could come home, man. I'm ready to come home. I miss my family. There you go, Rabbit. Y'all give me that. You know, let's push that energy towards that, man. Y'all push that energy and that good vibe. There you go, baby. Y'all push that energy. CC, thank you, bro. Y'all push that good energy out here, man. I need that because uh, tomorrow I'm going to go ahead and take that test. And... We're praying that that test come back negative so I can go ahead and hop on the flight. Um, I'll be able to leave 72 hours after I get that negative result. So if I get it tomorrow, I'll be able to enjoy the weekend, you know. I'll be able to hang out here tomorrow, go to the beach, and then uh, Sunday I can go to the beach. Trey, who the little ball here do this? <laughs> Who is the little ball headed man on here that you just posted, man? Who is the little ball headed dude is, son? You know? Um, but yeah, man, so tomorrow is the day that I take that test, man. And uh, I'm hoping that I take this test and I get that negative result. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, I, you know what? My son is supposed to be the next man up. He supposed to be when, 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 when. When the big man is away, the next man is supposed to step up. Trey, I need you to step up around the house and take care of my ladies while I'm away, you know? So I need you to step up, man. What's up, Tanisha? You know? But um, this day five, y'all, you know, uh, I'm still waiting. Uh, Monday will be 10 days, but... It'll be 10 days officially on Monday, but I, I, I've been counting it. So um, tomorrow will actually be 10 days. Well, I think, I don't know, y'all. I'm just throwed off on the dates and the time. I'm, I'm trying to figure this thing out. I'm trying to time it. You know, I'm just ready to come home, you know. So I, I, I'm going to take it on tomorrow. And I ain't even worried about Monday because tomorrow I'm going to get that negative result tomorrow. So 
I'm not even worried about Monday. I'm not even going to speak Monday into existence as far as taking that test, though, because I'm going to test out tomorrow, and then I'll be able to get up out of here. Monday morning, I'll be on a flight back home, and that's what I'm claiming, you know? So that's what I'm claiming. But it's still beautiful as ever out here, y'all, you know? They out here kicking it, man. They out here. Everybody's still out here. They out here kicking it in the still. They got my song, y'all. You know, they got a beautiful ocean. Y'all see it over there, the beautiful ocean. Still out here looking at paradise, you know? Unfortunately, I can't leave my room and go enjoy none of that, so I'm just going to sit in here and work. But I just got off work, y'all. I, um... I just got off work, so when I got off work, I said, let me go ahead and have me a beer. Let me get on live. Let me politic with the people. And, uh, yeah, it's beautiful. It's beautiful, Tanisha, and I'm I'm stuck in my room. I can't leave, you know, but it's beautiful, man. Um, Mexico, Cancun is a beautiful place, so if y'all never been to Cancun, y'all definitely should come to Cancun. Put it on your bucket list to come to Cancun. Uh, it's a beautiful place, man. The people out here, they're beautiful people. You know, my birthday was great. You know, um, and, and happy birthday to my bro, because his birthday was on the 6th. You know, God bless my bro, man. Uh, so, yeah, man, it, it was great, man. It was just, I came out here for my birthday. I had a great time. Um, it was time for me to test. We had to test 72 hours before we left. My wife came back negative. I came back positive. Just to give y'all an update on what's going on, if y'all just not seeing the uh, vlogs or things like that. But when we tested last Saturday, mine came back negative. I mean, positive. Hey, what's up, Benjamin? Mine came. Oh, okay, Terry is on the 26. I knew it was somewhere in there, but um, my wife came back negative. I came back positive, so I had to stay here in Mexico for another 10 to 14 days until I get that negative result. So tomorrow I'm going to take that test tomorrow. And uh, <clears throat> and we're going to pray. we praying that come tomorrow I get that negative result so I could come back home, you know. Uh, yes, do it live, man. I definitely tune in. That was my bro. One of the first guys I met when I moved to Indiana, he took me in like a brother and loved me like a brother. Him and Julius, you know, they love me like a brother, man. He knows my brothers for life, you know. And uh, thank you. Thank you. I will be home. I'm claiming it. Hey, Miss Gwen, I'm claiming it. I will be home. Moose Moose, they go my brother. Moose Man, what's up, bro? How you doing, man? Yeah, I'm, I'm going to be home, y'all. I'm coming home, man. So... You know, um, yeah, yes, indeed, yes. Trey, who this dude is, Trey? <laughs> My son is crazy, man. But, hey, yo, I, I accept it, man. Thank you, son. You know, thank you. Uh, today, I helped a lot of people today, man. I, uh, listen, I'm going to tell y'all something about, about what I do, right? I'm 2,500 miles away from my home, and I'm, I'm, I'm just thankful to be in a position where I run my own company, where I can work from wherever I'm at. I'm thankful for that, you know? Um, I had so many conversations today where I, um, I, feel, I feel good, Gwen, you know, I ain't got no symptoms. That's the biggest thing, like, I don't have no symptoms, but I feel really good, you know? My spirit up, my vibration up, you know, uh, my relationship with God is strong. I feel good, y'all. I feel great, you know. So, so I'm just thankful for that. Like, I, like I said on the video I posted yesterday or the day before, this was just God getting my attention to slow me down, to sit me down for a minute, because it's things that I have to do. And as long as I was on go, 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 go mode. I wasn't going to slow down. I wasn't going to sit down. You know, I'm, I'm going to tell y'all, man, I was only getting like four hours of sleep at home when I was at home. You know, I, I go to bed late. I wake up early, you know, and this was a consistent thing. 
You know, this was a consistent thing. So maybe this was God saying, Joe, let me sit you down for a minute before you you work so hard and you end up hurting yourself physically. You know, so so let me sit you down. Maybe that's what God was telling me to do. I got a higher calling on my life and I understand that. And I know, I know, I know, you know, I know that. I've been knowing that all my life. I know that. So I look at it from several different angles. I look at it from different ways and different points of view that this is just God trying to get my attention, you know, to sit down and pay attention to things that I need to be doing, you know? So, 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 and that's why I'm sitting over here diagnosed with this, this deadly disease and I don't have any symptoms because God, like, man, I'm not going to make you suffer through this, but I need you, I need to do something. It, it wasn't nothing else that was going to be done for me to be able to sit down for a minute. Because if I would have been back on that plane, back home in Atlanta, I would have been back on go, 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 go. You know, so right now I'm understanding to the point. I'm like, okay, let me sit down and chill. So moving forward, man, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to rush anything else in my life. I'm going to be patient on everything. I'm going to move the way I'm supposed to, you know. But back to what I was saying, man, like, I I had so many conversations during my day from 10 o'clock to 6 o'clock in the, in the evening. I have so many conversations, and there'd be so many lives that I touch over the phone. People would literally break down and... and um. Yes, there you go. Yeah, there you go. You know, and, and, and I'm going to get pulled out of this fire as well. Just like, uh, I can't remember those three guys' names. I know, uh, I can't remember the guy's name that, 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 that he walked in the furnace and pulled him out of there. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to get pulled out of this furnace, man. You know? And uh, it's a good thing, man. But I'm just thankful, man. You know? Chop, chop. What up, chop? What's going on, chop? There go my bro, chop. What's going on, man? Um, but yeah, man, I just been out here working. I've been doing the same thing, working every day. Uh, I've been doing my 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 my, my exercise here. You know, uh, I think I actually lost some weight since I've been here. That's a beautiful thing too. You know, I think I lost some weight. I be looking at myself in the mirror, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, oh, Joe, I think I see it coming off me. But when I get back home, I, I'll be able to, my wife did tell me if I lost weight or not. My son and my kids did tell me. But I think, you know, I've been looking in the mirror, so I'm thinking like, all right, Joe, you slamming up a little bit, you know? So it's good, man. It's good. No complaints. Uh, just homesick a little bit. You know, thank you, bro. Thank you, man. Tomorrow, I'm going to retest tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to retest tomorrow, and uh, and we're going to see what it do. Y'all see my shirt, y'all? See my shirt? Martin University, big brother. You know, Martin University. Y'all see this is the skeleton key. I got the skeleton key right here, and I got it right here. Got the skeleton key in my heart. So, yeah. But, uh. But yeah, man, I'm just um, I'm just out here chilling, y'all. That's it. That's it. I don't really have a lot to talk about today. I just, like I said, I just wanted to come on here and uh, show face and let you all know that I am still in good spirits. I'm still doing well. Uh, I'm riding this thing out, you know. I'm riding this thing out, man, and. Uh, and I'm just waiting on that negative result so I can get home. Uh, and then when I get home, man, I'm just going to really just really be more obedient. I'm going to be more obedient because it's something that I need to do. I don't know what it is yet, but it's something that God is requiring me to do. So I'm just going to continue to be obedient. Yeah. But, um, that's it, man. I ain't going to be on here long today. Uh, tonight, all my family, um, my cousin want to do a, a, a virtual party for me tonight because <laughs> I'm away. So 
uh, my family and friends, we're going to meet up on Messenger. Um, tonight, we're going to be on Messenger. Uh, we're going to add everybody on Messenger. And y'all know we did it last time, family. And we're going to meet everybody on Messenger. And we're just going to sit back and kick it, chill, vibe, you know, and enjoy each other, you know. But, um, yeah, so with that being said, man, I love y'all. Y'all be good. Y'all put them prayers up for me, you know. Um, thank you, Jonathan. I will, bro. Uh, I, I, I just took, I took my last vitamin C today. I still got elderberry, but I ran out of vitamin C. So <laughs> that's just probably a sign right there showing that I'm leaving soon. So I'm, I'm, I'm coming home soon because I don't have no more vitamin C to take care. Of. But I still got a lot of elderberry. Um, and I still got my, my other supplements here and everything. But I don't have no more vitamin C uh, pills here at all. So, so that's it, man. But um, yeah. So I'm just going to sit here, watch this beautiful creation, watch the ocean, look at the ocean, um, and just vibe out, man. I'm just going to chill out and relax. So I hope y'all had a great week. Uh, okay. Okay, Jonathan, I definitely will, bro. Uh, I definitely will. I love you too, mama. Love you too, mama. I'll be home soon, you know. I'll be home soon. I'm just, um, yeah, bro, I'm just going to vibe out, man. I'm just going to enjoy the scenery, enjoy this beautiful creation that God created. Um, and I'm just going to sit up here and finish finish this out, man, and um, wait till tomorrow, because I know tomorrow when I take that test, it's going to come back negative. And then um, let me ask you this. Let me ask y'all this real quick. Um, and y'all might know this. When they stick that thing up your nose, right? Uh, if you got a common cold, would that common cold trigger a, a, a positive result for COVID? That's what I want to know. Or is it something, is, is that COVID, I guess they call it SARS-2, COVID-19, uh, is that different from a common cold? Can they cipher between the two with that test? That's what I want to know. Because I, I, I want to know that. Yeah. Cause I still got, I still got mucus. Uh, I still got like a little congestion, you know. And I'm praying that 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 it don't trigger something on that test to say that I'm positive when it's just a common cold that I'm dealing with. That's what I'm concerned about. But I ain't worried. But I'm concerned about that because I don't want to keep. Because until this, until all this mucus dry up and everything drop. If that's the case, it'll keep on coming back positive if it's reading like that, you know? And I don't want to keep getting, I don't want that to keep happening to me. So I've been trying to blow my nose. I've been trying to keep, keep, keep my, keep everything in there dry. So when they do take that test, you know, I, I don't know. One of my guys said, get some nasal spray and <laughs> spray that nasal spray up there before you take the test and this and that, man. I, I don't know, man. You know, I don't know. But I just know I, I know I need a I need a negative result so I can come home. Yeah. And Lord knows I don't wanna I don't wanna stay here a half a month, over a half a month. I don't wanna be in Mexico over a half a month, you know. Okay, okay, Jonathan, that's a bet, bro. I'm going to inbox you today. Yeah. I don't have no steam, Chop. I don't got no steam, Chop. I'm in this room. I don't have no stove. 
you know. I don't got no stove chop, so I can't. I can't do no. I was I was trying to figure out a way to do some type of steam treatment, but I don't got no stove in this room chop, so I'm I'm stuck on that, man. Yeah, I've been taking these pills. Uh, bathroom shower. I cut that water on then. I cut that hot water on and see if I can crank up some steam or something, man. Yeah. Man, y'all, it's so beautiful out here, man. If I wasn't, I wish, you know, it's beautiful out here, y'all. If y'all ain't never been to Cancun, Mexico, I got a chance to go to the Tulum, the uh, the Mayan ruins uh, before all of this. Uh, okay. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it today, Chop. Yeah, I'm going to do it today. But I got a chance to, uh, before all of this, y'all, on Friday, last Friday, me and my wife, we went to the Mayan ruins out in Tulum. And, um, man, listen, when you go and look at things that was built years ago, years ago, and they show it like, like man, it's it's just so powerful, man, when you there and you look at how like nowadays we got all this modern day technology and things like that and different tools and things like that. But back in the days they didn't have all of those tools. So to go out there and see some of the things that they built and some of the buildings that they built out there, uh, without these tools, man, you like, man, you know, God really created some powerful people out here in this world, man. And the same mind and the same brain power that those people had back in those days, we got that same capabilities now, you know, but we have to learn how to start using that thing to pull all of that beauty from outside of here and bring it out to the world and showcase it to the people, you know. Um, but it, 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 it's, it's been an experience right here, man. This, this has been a real experience. Uh the people here in, in Mexico, they are very nice. You know, um, you're not judged out here because of the way you look or your skin complexion. You're not judged. Uh, people seem to be genuine. Now, don't get me wrong. They got a hood everywhere you go. You know, got bad people everywhere you go. But for the most part, man, a lot of the people out here that I met, and a lot of people that's been out here, they've been really good people and they've been really helpful. You know, they do, they message me and make sure I'm okay. They check in on me every day. Uh, they ask me if I need anything. You know, they, they, they make sure that I'm, I'm good. You know, it's been a really good, it's, it's been a really good uh, experience, just experiencing um, the humanity of people, you know, nice people, you know, so it's been a good thing. Uh, well, I'm gone, y'all. I love y'all, man. I, I talk to y'all later. And uh, y'all be good. Y'all have a blessed weekend, man. I love y'all. Thanks for tuning in. Tomorrow, I will get that negative result tomorrow. And uh, when I get that negative result, I'm going to let everybody know that I will be coming home. So I talk to y'all later, man. I love y'all. Peace.